you're obviously a global artist and your partner is a world-renowned footballer, but at home you must be Shakira the mum and <laughs> Gerard must be, he's the dad. What's, what's, what's kind of Shakira the mum like? Um, well, I am a little bit of a tiger mom, speaking of which. I like to, I like to teach him. Teach him. I'm, I have like a little teacher inside of me. I, I really love, I enjoy reading to my kids and, and they, they, they like learning too. It's a good relationship because uh, Milan at least is very, very eager to learn. He loves letters, he loves numbers. He goes, and I think every kid does if you present it to them as a, as a game, you know, if you present it with joy and, and they feel that, there are, that the time that they're learning, they're also um, sharing with their parents and because they feel important and they feel valued because you're dedicating all that time to them. Um, so I am, I'm pretty devoted to them, their education. Like I say, I, I also depend, rely on research and a lot of research I like mm -hmm. to find out what are the best ways of stimulating my children and and also dealing with whatever difficulties and obstacles I might encounter uh, in the process of, of, of being a mother every day. Um, and I also like to give him lots of love and you know, very touchy-touchy mm. and hug him and kiss him to death. <laughs> <laughs> very intense, let's put it that way. I think I'm gonna leave my house when they're 18, well, for sure. They're like, bye mom, well, they may know I'm out of here. <laughs> they may know they're onto a good thing and not leave. <laughs> we saw a lovely video of, um, of, of you with Sasha um, kicking a ball. So will, will, you, will you teach both of them to dance at all? To what? To, to dance. To dance. Um, uh, well, they see me dance, they see me sing, I, I do it, I, I just, I goof around the house and, and they enjoy it, but they're very much into football. Uh. So far, um, I, I don't think I have dancers in my house yet, <laughs> but you, you never know. It's, it's too early to tell. Uh, they're constantly changing. Right now, Milan is obsessed with football. You have no idea. It's like the biggest Barca fan there is in, on the planet. He sleeps with the Barca jersey on, and he sleeps with the ball, sometimes with a soccer ball. He, um, he doesn't miss one match. Uh, he knows every single team uh, uh, there is in the world, even, including England, like he knows about Chelsea, Arsenal, Manchester United. He wears the t-shirts of all the teams sometimes yeah. because he likes to play around. <laughs> so, so far he's just into football, very much so. We've obviously heard a lot today about mum saying that happiness is the most important personality trait for their children, but how can we as parents teach our children to be happy? Uh, well, it's something I'm learning as, as I go because I'm, I'm new at this, <laughs> relatively new as a mom. Um, but I can tell you it's the most difficult job I've ever had. Um, I also want the happiness for my kids. Uh, I also want them to be responsible and I want them to be uh, socially conscious. And I want so many things for them, mm -hmm. but happiness is without a doubt uh, my number one priority. Uh, I think the mother of happiness is love. Mm -hmm. It really is. So that's the the question I ask myself every morning when I wake up. I mean, making my kids feel loved, and I'm sure everything I do for them I do out of love. But not always it comes across that way for the little minds. You know, I want to make it clear. I want them to count on that love to make them to make their minds really strong and and healthy and and to help them develop with this sense of confidence and security mm -hmm. love is the most important thing of course and and you talk about how you learn keep learning as a parent today we've had about mums all across the world and their different attitudes and, mm -hmm. and things that they do mm -hmm. is there anything you've heard today that you'll take away and it would actually change the way that you bring up your boys of course, I, I always learn from other moms. I learn from uh, the research that I stumble across. I, I'm, I'm restless in that sense. I'm always uh, trying to find answers to my questions because it's not easy. And that's why we also la la uh, launching this, this app because I feel like um, 
And it's great that you're parenting a website too because it's 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 so important. I think women women out there need need support and so the more support they get the better for for the children mm -hmm. children and their future.